moderators, welcome to our next session in Baby Literary Essay. Today we're talking about how debaters explain why their evidence matters. Because you ever been in a conversation with someone and they tell you like a really cool fact, but you're not quite getting it? Like, why is it cool? And you kind of pause and you wait for them to maybe explain more and clue you in and why it's really cool. We never want our readers to feel like that when they're reading our writing, especially because we're not right there to tell them about it. We don't want them to look at what we put in as evidence and go, yeah, so what? Who cares? We need to passionately tell them why our evidence matters. So this is what you need to know, readers or writers. Debaters convince someone of the strength of your position. And a debater just doesn't just hope that your reader understands your evidence. A debater explains why this evidence matters. And I know we asked you to do this in your draft the other day, but today this is really going to be your focus, going back and explain why the evidence matters. So here's my original essay. Ray in Indian Shoes is more creative than Opal and because of Winn-Dixie. One part that shows this is when Ray offers to buy the moccasins. In the text, Ray says, I'll give you $28.67 for the moccasins. He told Junior Murphy, and I'll pick up every last button too. Another part that shows this is when Ray stops the lady and offers to trade his shoes for the moccasin. He tells her that they're for sure Indian worn. So there's tons of evidence in here. I answered a question and I gave some proof, but I didn't explain why my proof mattered. So let's take a look at this redraft. Ray in Indian Shoes is more creative than Opal in Because of Winn-Dixie. One part that shows this is when Ray offers to buy the moccasins. In the text, Ray says, I'll give you $28.67 for the moccasins, he told Junior Murphy, and I'll pick up every last button too. Now here in red, I'm adding a sentence or two explaining why this supports my claim. This is important, and that was one of my sentence starters from the other day because it shows Ray being extra creative since he's offering to do work for Junior since he doesn't have enough money to pay him. Oh, now I can see why that matters. Another part that shows this is when Ray stops the lady and offers to trade his shoes for the moccasins. He tells her that they're for sure Indian worn. This part clearly shows Ray is creative because he knows the woman wanted to get shoes that were worn by an American Indian, and Ray's shoes definitely were, since Ray is Cherokee Seminole. So now I explain the evidence, because I could have put that evidence towards different claims, but I had to explain why it was important to my claim. So debaters explain why evidence matters. And here are some helpful sentence starters when you go back and work on your draft today. This matters because... The reason this quote is important is, a lot of readers might miss this part. It's important though because, in other words, and this part clearly shows blank, which is a great chance to put your big bold idea back in there, because. One other thing that I want to point out today while you're going back and looking over your drafts is remembering the rules for titles. You need to be capitalizing all important words and underlining the titles of books. So if we go back to my draft, I have Indian Shoes in quotes because Indian Shoes is the name of a short story, but because of Winn-Dixie is underlined because it is a title. Now let's take a look at your student notebook for today. So right here you have your job today. You're going back to the body of your flash draft. You're finding your evidence and you're explaining why by adding one to two sentences. And you have your sentence starters here. One big tip though, because you're going back to a draft you've already written, if you don't have room, you can add in things on sticky notes if you need to. And then later today, when you finish revising your draft, you're going to start typing up your draft. All right, friends, off you go. I can't wait to see um, your explanations for why your evidence matters.